In this video today, I'm gonna to show you how to display all your duplicates in your Apple Music so you can go through them, delete them, and free up space on your laptop. Let's get into it. What's going on, people? I go by the name of DJ CB, and on this channel, we talk about music organization and making your life easier as a DJ. If you like the sound of that, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below, and don't forget to hit that bell notification to get notified every single time I post a video. Let's head over to iTunes. So in iTunes right now, you need to make sure that you're in your songs part of your library and obviously make sure that you have some sort of music in your Apple Music library. At the moment, I've got 17,000 songs in here, so I have quite a few tracks and I'm sure there's a lot of duplicates in here. To show all the duplicates, all you need to do is go to the top here, click File, Library, and then Show Duplicate Items. And as you can see, these are all the duplicated tracks in my music library. So I've got two of these, two of these, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera, et cetera. At the bottom, you can see there's 870 songs, 6.17 gigabytes of music, which is duplicates. So you can actually half this and get rid of three gigabyte because you're gonna be getting rid of half the songs in here. So what you can do is highlight each one and then delete them. That way you'll free up memory on your laptop and you'll be able to download brand new music without clogging up any space. If you found this video helpful, make sure you give it a thumbs up. If you haven't done so already, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below and don't forget to hit that bell notification to get notified every single time I post a video. If you've got this far in the video, type yes in the comments so I can thank you personally. With that being said, I go by the name of DJ CB and we're out.